Hey guys, I thought I'd do this fun little video and I'd just uh, show you all my Game of Thrones stuff because obviously you know I love the show and of course I have some, a lot of stuff. So not as much as others, but, and it, my collection will eventually get even bigger. But for now, I'm actually very pleased with my collection. First of all, those little sit first before I get, those are just from a poster I had. And it just got so ratty on the edges that I decided to get rid of it. But then, it, but that, but I decided I still wanted the sigil, so I just cut them out, taped them to my wall, and then I got, and then I made, and then I have two hand-drawn sigils I made. I have the Stark Direwolf and the Martell uh, Sun and Spear. I drew it myself, and of course I have an IMAX poster of Game of Thrones from when I went to the IMAX showing, which was amazing. So yeah. And here is the stuff I have. First of all, you of course I have all four all well all four seasons available that on DVD. And eventually I will collect um upgrade these to Blu-ray. Um because I have mostly DVDs right now and but I'm gonna start collecting only Blu-rays for movies, but I'm gonna get my shows on DVD and then eventually update on them on Blu-ray. But yeah. I have to say Season 1 and Season 4 are tied for my favorite at the moment, and then Season 3 will be my second favorite, and then Season 4 will, I mean, Season 2 will be my last favorite. Um, yeah. So I'm hoping that Season 2 will be my favorite, even though, not Season 2, Season 5 will be my new favorite season, even though they're going to depart a lot from the books. So, yeah. And then, of course, I have... See, I got, and I'm trying to collect as many of the characters and figures in any figure I can. First of all, I got the, um, and these are the collectible well, vinyl figures. Let's see, I got Jon Snow, I got Viserion, I got Little Arya, Ned, Ghost, uh, Tyrion, my favorite character, and of course, a White Walker, though it's not the glow-in-the-dark one, unfortunately. Um, let's see, what else? I got a Game of Thrones magazine, though I would have preferred to have the one with Tyrion or Jon or Arya, anyone but Daenerys, because I'm not really happy with her at the moment, but still, it's a great magazine, and a lot, of, really, has some really good info, and then, of course, my pop, Funko Pops, let's see. let's see, the first one I got is T the one with Tyrion in his battle armor, and see, got the scar, the axe, and the awesome Lannister uh, armor, and then I think the one I got after that was the King in the North, Rob Stark, and I really wish they had given him a crown to wear in the show, because he had, I know, he, even though I haven't read books two and three yet. I'm halfway through uh, one, and I finished the fourth and fifth. Um, I do know that he has a crown, and I would have liked to see it in the show, but you know, whatever. Um, and then the next I got was Renly. See, he got his nice Baratheon armor with the cape over it, and then the awesome stag crown. I love that. And then I think the next I got after that uh... I think, I don't know which order I got these, but I got Season 2 Daenerys. I plan on getting all the Daenerys's, because they have one for Season 1, 2, 3, and I think they have one for 4, so yeah. And then, of course, the ha uh, the Jon Snow, when he just arrived at the Night uh, Night's Watch with uh, Longclaw, his sword. And there's another one of him frowning, so that's probably the one after Egret dies and he becomes Lord Commander. And then, of course, I have Arya with Little Needle. Of course, like, I love Arya. Even though I was not happy with what she did at the end of Season 4, I still overall love her as a character. And then, of course, I got I, Joffrey. I mean, I have to have Joffrey. I mean, even though I hated Joffrey, he still was one of my favorite characters because I love to hate him so much. And he's probably... I would say not only one of the best uh, TV villains, but one of the best villains, period. Like, yeah, Joffrey was an amazing villain. And then I got 
season one Jamie and his Kingsguard, and see he still has the long hair. And then, of course, uh, Cersei. I hate Cersei, but, you know, I love to hate Cersei. So, I mean, Leah Heaney is amazing. And then I got, I got this one last week. I got Oberyn Martell, the Red Viper, in his uh, armor and then his beard. Spear. And then these are my newest uh, pickups, my very newest. I got Peter Baelish. I got Dark Sansa, see? And then I got this. This is a Hot Topic ex exclusive pre-release. And this is the uh, Jamie Lannister with his golden hand. See, if you really pay attention, you can tell. And I love it. I mean, I still need, I mean, they have other figures. Like, I still need to get Sam and the Grey Worm and the Mountain, but yeah. So, yeah, and then, of course, I got my gorgeous uh, World of Ice and Fire book. It's just, I freaking love this book. I already did a review on it, but it's still as gorgeous. It's, like, all these amazing illustrations. See, uh, if you can see, that's River Run right there in that picture, but, yeah. And then, just for kicks and giggles, here is a drawing of uh, Dragonstone. That's gorgeous. I stared at it for a good, like, ten minutes once. Just, it's gorgeous. I love this book. I mean, now that I'm reading the book, the actual books, you know, um, I mean, some of the stuff doesn't add up, you know, but for the most part, I still think this is a great book. Um, and the illustrations are freaking amazing. And then, of course, my favorite, one, some of my favorite things. Also, um, I do have a book. I have the fourth and the first book on my Kindle, and then I have the fourth, the first, and the uh, fifth book on Audible. So, yeah. And so, of course, and last but not, certainly not least, I got my, all my t-shirts. Got the Stark, Stark Pride right here. Uh... Another Stark shirt, but this is more for the North. The North remembers. I wear the, a lot of these shirts all, all, all the time, so. Um, let's see. All Men Must Die. Sure, I love this shirt. Um, let's see. I got Night's Watch. I always feel weird when I wear this shirt because it says, like, I will take no wife, father, no children. And it's like, well, I'm, you know, it's, it's weird, but I still love this shirt. Uh, I got my Targaryen pride shirt. I mean, even though I'm not happy with Daenerys right now, there's still a lot of Targaryens in the past that I adore. Um, and then my favorite of my older Game of Thrones uh, t-shirts, it's definitely this. See, we got, and it makes sense where they're all placed, like the Starks versus the Lannisters and the Baratheons versus the Targaryens. And then my newest of my GOT shirts, I've already worn both of these, but here's uh, the Stark Direwolf with the uh, map of the north. It's beautiful. I mean, I can never have enough Stark shirts. And then, uh, like, the Three-Eyed Raven shirt, and that's the Weirwood tree, so yeah. And I also plan to get more shirts, like, just fun saying shirts. And I plan to get a shirt from every house, even the Greyjoys. Like, these, I don't really care that much for the Greyjoys at the moment. Not, uh, certainly not in the show. Though, I don't, I do feel bad for Theon. <laughs> and I'm not really mad at him anymore for what he did, but yeah. So, that's all my Game of Thrones stuff. Um, yeah, I'm obviously, you can tell that I love the show just by all the crap I have. And of course, I will be getting more stuff eventually. But yeah, those are all my... That's all my Game of Thrones paraphernalia. So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. And also, my next video will be a rain review. Obviously, it will be later tonight because I have a, I'm babysitting like at 6:30, so I won't be able to watch the episode live. But I will watch it as soon as I get home. And then tomorrow, I will be seeing Paul Blart Mall Cop 2. I am not looking forward to it at all, but I feel it feel it is my duty to watch it. And I have a feeling that it's going to end up as my worst movie of the year so far. So, yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.